This round starting like the last round. <laughs> mm. Goes with a right hander. Over the top, overhand, right, and then. And I was expecting this fight to be heat up early because I uh, since this my fires off that left hook to the body. Four punch combination. At this point, Gonzalez, Gonzalez got good solid defense, but he put his with a double left hand body and head. Oh, Santisma digs. I know the ref wants Santisma to, to break, but it's not time. He's straight right. Right hand tries to wrap around that elbow, but he's only landing 21% of those total punches. Trying to win. He's not just laying back. Even when he has those moments right there, Gonzalez, I like the punch selection. Look at that. I just don't look at that. Good work right look there. Look at that. Obey my commands at all times and protect us off at all times. Good luck. Getting a lot of credit. And we talked to him about that. He got outboxed against Shakur Stevenson. Went to war. Yeah, I totally believe. But you got to see if there's any ill effects in this fight. Skills. He has the ability. And he also has the mindset. Leave that. This young man, and I told him in the fighter meeting. Mm. Goes with a right hand. Second of 2020. Knockout by Navarrete. Trying to wrap that right. That was an 11th round. The left hand jab and then the uppercut. Knowing when to box. Hand around the guard of Gonzalez. Gonzalez. But I think right now, Santissima, what he's doing. Here. Over the top, overhand, right, and then jabs. And triples it up, does the thing. Fan of that defense that Gonzalez, you, you know, that's not the best defense to use. Those shots are getting through to the body and to the head, and they could. was that. Ten seconds. In that fight with Navarrete, moving your head or using your feet to get out of range. Time! So the instructions from his Navarrete, far too many chances. Uh, oh. with that kind of defense because he's going to find an Navarrete is the and I was expecting this fight to be heat up early because this is a technical battle so far total punches in that first round Santissima fires off that left hook to the body four punch combination mm. Santissima was 10 of 50 Gonz 29 Nice shot. Both men doing work on the inside. Grown man type punches. He really that body is. shot was one of them. He can come forward. Yes, he was sitting back, laying back. Oh. Gonzalez now picking up the pace and the tempo. He's moving Gonzalez to the position he wants. Can jab. I understand what you're saying, but also he Gonzalez didn't make him pay for that. At this point, Gonzalez. End of two here in Fresno as we up in up to 74. Gonzalez a little more efficient with less work rate. 25. Sort of speaking, his pocket. He doesn't throw off and he doesn't counter. He Gonzalez got good solid defense, but he put his. The other is issue with him. And right in. You hear him throwing the punch with everything he's got when he could have or his jab. Two double jabs and threw the same punch with less effort. Makes life a lot easier. Mm, nice short shot right there. Nice Came off the shot right there from Gonzalez underneath. Both men has been effective early on in this fight. With a double left hand body and head. Oh, Santisma dig. Good exchange on the. I know the ref wants Santisma to, to break, but it's not time. Gonzalez to get away from that overhand right now. Turns the table. Hit to the rope so I can do what I'm doing right now. Watch out, that don't, don't repeat. Now trying to close that gap and get back to the end. Again, Santisma. Right hand scores well. Time! For J.O. Santissima. The Stop! Certain rounds and 
when he's down or when he needs to pick up 26. This is his 26 fight. Still learning to be a winner. Too. All those nuances come with being elite, and he's got to continue. Ultra elite when you talk about being outclassed when he stepped up and losing two of his last three. Obviously, started his career 23 and 0, and then the level of competition. He proved that he's a guy that can not just be in big fights, but he can win. And then taking on Emmanuel Navarrete, who's a human chain fights that we need to win. I just need you to be a warrior. I need you to be a winner. We got to learn how to win the fight. that road, them ropes. There's nowhere to go. Right now, what he needs to be telling his son. Yeah, I think both guys, Drake, can do more. And they feel that if they expose themselves, you don't want to be against the ropes. They can leave an opening. See the action. And a four. Bit of an interview in terms of the use of the left hand for Gonzalez to make. But Gonzalez has a 68 to 53. Nice said in the last round that fire off the block, but keep it clean so the judges can see they have to make up their mind that they want to pull away for Gonzalez the way he does that. Allow Santissima to think. If you stay busy, you will have made in terms of the way he blocks punches. He's only win this fight. What the judges see, though, because it's, it, as you guys have said, listen, you're still touching 19% because of Gonzalez's defense. To me, it's but they're not landing. You're not being effective. That's hard. To Clearly, being more effective. There's no doubt about that. He's landing 44. And off, and now you see Gonzalez mobbing forward. And then all of a sudden, some switch, a switch went in. He was taking the initiative. He was coming at Gonzalez. corner and you heard him simply saying you got to work good work from the start middle of the ring good exchange volume it's straight right Michael Domingo's instructions for Jerry Santissimo is, is that don't leave with the jab because he sees is used to fighting instead of getting his and not allowing this is just a bad habit that Gonzalez. When he's throwing the jab. That's how you win rounds and you win. It's fine. And when they're locked in together, Santissima will have distance. When Joette has him on the end. Gonzalez has success. Now he's trying to take the heart of Santissima. The six punches. Nice exchange here in the midst of round six. But it's just. Don't allow Santissima to come right back. Left Excuse hand to the body and then up top from Santissima. Goes towards that belt line himself. Look for the uppercut. Gonzalez answers right away. And Gonzalez, to his credit, he is blocking a lot of Right hand tries to wrap around that elbow. But he's only landing 21% of those total punches. It is, is you never know what the judges are scoring. Yes, Signu of Richard Torres, and then the much-anticipated Oscar Valdez. Oh, yes, it is. Of course, and I Canelo will be fighting in men. He's looking for a way to try to win. He's always pressing the issue. <laughs> then you got to risk trying to win. He's not just laying back. Even when he has those moments right there, it's combinations. <laughs> yeah, anybody... That allows Santissimo to get his own shot, just like he did right there. Head, so he's a guy that... Landing headshots. But it's never a bad idea to keep going downstairs, especially last round when he said that the distance. I think Mark had a really good point. Distance. Then stand inside that pocket where you have... Gonzalez, I like the punch selection. Look at that. I just don't... Look at that. Good work right Look at there. That. To come back with his offense. Good stuff. Gonzalez There's some arm. shorter arm fighter in Santissima that can. Some body shots on the inside that were quite effective. That was a heck of a. Especially anybody that comes from the Philippines. Trust me on that. This work to go 40 out of 75. This round starting like the last round. <laughs> exactly. Yes. But, but, we don't know what. Junior, the American silver medalist. He is calm. And this young man throws a lot of punches. He's always marching forward. And he Doc, get ready to come in. <laughs> nice. nice Riding shot. a right hand down. <laughs> when is heating up? A lot of headshots right now. 
As you can see, fatigue, you can my friend. fight with Navarrete all the way through. 12 rounds with so. Double uppercuts yeah. coming right back. Close thing. Let him gas out a bit and then attack him like round number nine. Gonzalez needs to jump. He did. Bernardo, what are they saying in that Santissima? The referee is very concerned about Santissima. Gonzalez. He's trying to dig right to that belt line, then comes up top with the right hand. That's the reason why he swells. Of course, he had a concern for Santissima. See, that's just smart, you know. Gotta hit him as well. Let's do straight hey, shots right that's down. That's it. it. That's that it. right that's hand it. ends it. Edward Calantes, but he had been warned about the amount of damage he was taking. I say about that 50. You say if it's 50, it's over. It's gonna be over. The ninth rounder. You just watched the replay, Timmy. But that right hand, boom, looping right hand. Hypersensitive to anything. Listen, listen I'm, hold on, let me finish. Referee Edward Corantes calls a stop to this bout, declaring your winner by technical knockout and Gonzalez. Thousand fights ringside, right? <laughs> Is that Dre nails? They have seen nothing. To me, right there. Just.